This Breakfast with Lazy Gaming Guy short has been brought to you by Audible.com. Get a free audiobook download and a 30 day free trial by going to www.audibletrials.com slash media or clicking on the link below. So, oh, that actually does remind me of another topic that I don't know if we have. So, uh, I'm going to bring don't. it up. I yeah. guarantee I don't. Yeah, so, um, Sony, or uh, I guess Shuhei Yoshida, uh, Shuhei Yoshida. Um, is considering making um is, uh, is considering making um the um PlayStation VR PC compatible. Eventually, yeah, I Eventually. heard about that. Like, it's Which... it's definitely not something that's happening anytime soon. It's just it could happen. Which it could happen. It's interesting because, like, I've said multiple times, I've gone on record and saying this on the channel multiple times that well, when it comes to the they... PlayStation VR, you have a lot of records of that talking about it. Shut up. Anyways. Well, um, that that they were like that the that it would be good for a PlayStation VR to work on a PC. However, uh, I didn't think it was going to be it was going to work on PC natively. Way to prove me wrong, Sony. You know, just way to way to prove me wrong on that. It's gonna like we're well, trying to make it work on PC natively. Yeah, and again, it's something that it won't right out of the box immediately. Right now, work on PC. Like, when Mm -hmm. it comes out in October, as far as we know right now, it's not going to. But it might later on. They're aiming to try and add that later on. Yeah. Like a patch or something like that. I mean, that would be a really cool thing. I mean, like, yeah, that would just be, that would be, um, that's a really good idea on Sony's part. And plus, uh, to be perfectly honest, it would help because I guarantee the PC specs wouldn't have to be as extreme. Mm-hmm. Since, uh, if the, like, you would basically only have to have PC specs for PS4. Mm-hmm. Which, which most PCs are, like, most, like, current gaming PCs are more powerful than PS4 right, right now. Right, so all you'd have to do is buy a gaming PC, which, Okay, yeah, that's kind of expensive, but not nearly as expensive as an Oculus Rift PC or mm-hmm. even the Vive PC. Yeah. Like, so, just any normal gaming PC should be able to run the Sony VR perfectly fine. Or at yeah. least at a reasonable, acceptable level. So, yeah, that's actually... Um, like, yeah, that, that's actually a really, um, uh, I mean, a really good idea on Sony's part, honestly, because, like, 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 okay, let's garber back to one of our, one of our videos and say, like, what's gonna cause, you know, what's gonna, what's gonna wind up winning the, the this, like, VR war? Porn? Yeah. Yep. So, <laughs> like, this gives, this, the, the, honestly, I'm gonna have to straight up say it, this gives the PlayStation VR access to porn. Well, play, well, well. Most of Pornhub's most of Pornhub's Sony. customers come from PlayStation. Yeah. Come from PlayStation. So remember, Sony, don't add any con, <clears throat> add optional content filters. Optional, oh. like you know. Oh yeah, you can set parental controls on so your kid isn't playing VR porn. But remember to have none as well, so that we can you know enjoy our VR porn. What if some of us don't want VR porn? Then put on your parental controls or just don't buy it. Like, don't buy the VR porn. Like, you can play the PlayStation VR without the VR porn. It's just an added option. Options. <gasps> that's what they Japan, that's what we want. We I want have an options. idea for you. This gives me an idea. Speaking of VR, I have an idea for you. Japan, I need you to make a game where I'm a, where, where I'm a Super Sentai Tokusatsu, you know, freaking... You know, a common writer like character. Make a game like that, and I will be happy. 